Hello friends, welcome to our channel Bulls vs BS Trading Academy. In this video, we will discuss about the current situation in the Nifty and uh, analysis for tomorrow, that is 2nd March 2020. So here we have Nifty 50 chart in the time frame of our daily and uh, here we have Bank Nifty chart in the time frame of our daily. So Nifty is observing a huge selling from the past uh, one month, that is from this, uh, this was on 20 Jan 2020 and uh, Today is uh, March 1st, 2020. So from this day, we were uh, observing a huge selling in the Nifty. So the first selling phase was around, it was around 6% downfall, around 800 points. And after that, we observed some good buying in Nifty uh, at a 5% up move. And later now, from Feb 13th, uh, we are observing a huge selling in the nifty so the fall is around eight percent and that too in uh, 15 days one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven so in total of 11 working days we have observed a selling of 1000 points that is a downfall of 1000 points uh, this is a huge sell-off like if you see uh, the earning from uh, this is the date on 7th october so from 7th and 9th October, we have rallied uh, till 20 Jan. So that is around October, November, December, January, four months. Four months of up move is being eaten away in just uh, one and a half month. So this is from 20 Jan and this is our first March. So in one and a half month, we have eaten all the, what were the investments were there from this, uh, from this level that is from 20 uh, from uh, October month till Jan 19 so whatever the investments were made during this uh, period all the investments were completely down in just uh, one one and a half month that is from 20 Jan till today that is first March so you can see the momentum of a downfall in the nifty and also in the bank nifty also the same situation so there is a a breakout of this uh, virus across the world and all the economies are shutting down their businesses so it is impacting the stock market heavily the US Dow Jones is uh, falling continuously and uh, all the world markets are also into a huge sell-off so we can only expect that uh, selling will continue till some days so there are some crucial support and resistance areas for nifty uh, the support is 11,087 to 11,036. This is the first support area. This area shouldn't be broken. If at all, if uh, Nifty breaks this area, then uh, we can expect some more selling. And uh, the resistance area when Nifty goes up is uh, 11,326 to 11,377. So in the past video, I have told that Nifty can take a support over here and just give a pullback till 11,900 and from then we can see a good fall but what happened is that Nifty simply opened a gap down uh, 200 to 300 points gap down and uh, it uh, completely closed at the day's low so you can understand how weak is the market and uh, coming to Bank Nifty Bank Nifty also is the same you can see the sell off so whatever the investments were made from this level that is 24th October till this uh, high that is 19th Jan all the investments have become be, uh, zero today that is from this level this level has taken uh, four months of time and this move has taken only just uh, 25 days of time 30, uh, no, sorry it's one and a half uh, months of time so around 45 days so you can observe the huge sell off in the nifty and bank nifty and if at all if this continues uh, we can even break these levels and these levels and still go much below uh, just like what had happened in a 2008 crisis so in the 2008 crisis also we had seen a so much of sell off so this is how markets are currently now so if uh, nifty doesn't take support here tomorrow and breaks these levels then we can expect a huge sell off again and uh, maybe some good crashes in the economies and in the stock markets also so if you are trading for tomorrow then just be careful at these levels 11,036 to 11,087 and 11,326 to 11,377 and for bank nifty the level is 28,000 
and another uh, range is 29,522 to 29,630. So these two levels are most important for Bank Nifty tomorrow. And uh, if at all, if uh, Bank Nifty breaks these levels, then expect a huge selling again in the coming days for the next uh, few trading sessions. And uh, forget about this uh, expiries also because <laughs> the way markets are falling uh, and uh, all the uh, news are coming, there is no there is no expectation in the expiry days also now so everything is like just a uh, falling knife so try to avoid catching that falling knife and just try to enter in the downfall and just grab the good down moves so if you like this video give this video a thumbs up and also share with the other traders thanks for watching